Hello everybody, this is Chad Guzman. I have decided to put together some videos of uh, my shoulder therapy that I've been using. I've had issues with my shoulders since my accident in 1990. And this is some of the stuff I've learned from watching some of Edo Portal's videos and I will share that link to you from his website. But I've pretty much um, trying to adapt the theory into applying it to, you know, being disabled and using his protocols. As you can see here, I'm gently stretching my shoulders out. Usually do each arm for a couple seconds, hold the stretch. This one uh, really gets the front of the shoulder. And when you turn your wrist over, you can feel it go down, the stretch go down your arm. Also, with my head over in this angle, my left shoulder, I'm hanging my weight off the left side and it stretches under the armpit really well. So this, this stretch actually stretches two parts, the right shoulder in the front and underneath the left shoulder. I go back and forth on each shoulder a few times until I feel confident that uh, the, the muscles are stretched out and loose. Um, I try to do it without pain, uh, so your comfort level may vary, but I try not to stretch into too much into a painful area. Here I've transitioned into stretching out underneath both arms closing my eyes and just feeling, paying attention to how the shoulders feel, relaxing, kind of like a yoga mentality. Here transitioning to putting some weight on my shoulders and gently swinging back and forth. Ido Portal's protocol consists of dead hanging, not so much doing active pull-ups, but um, just the act of holding on and stretching does make a difference. In the earlier days, I did used to do a lot of pull-ups. <clears throat> um, at this point, my shoulders were not well enough to do that, so this passive Hanging strengthens those smaller muscles around the joint. I try to breathe into the stretch and relax. This is tape, tape is sped up, so it looks like I'm doing more. Often while breathing into the stretch you can f and relaxing, you can feel you know, sensitive muscles uh, trying to guard themselves and twitching and the key is to relax and try to let those muscles release and passively hang on them. So I'd like to point out, uh, you know, I'm not a doctor, but this is just how I have been trying to address my shoulder issues. Take from it what, what you will. Again, I've just sped up the tape here to illustrate what I'm doing. Go at your own pace if you choose to do something like this and you know make it relaxing and therapeutic. Don't be in a hurry to do this.
So I've set the height of my rings up so that I can use them both while in the chair and also if I'm seated on the ground. When I'm seated on the ground, I can barely reach the rings and I really can get a elongated stretch and I can push the envelope around the joint, swinging in circles, back and forth, lifting myself up a little bit, holding myself, again, not doing pull-ups, more of a passive hang and trying to work through a range of motion. This video was shot uh, prior to my surgery, shoulder surgery, on my right sh shoulder that I had in mid-July. I didn't fully know the extent of the problem at that point, but I was trying, uh, I had issues and I was trying to work through them without sur surgical intervention. In my future videos, I'll sh I have other apparatuses, uh, which I'll get into, 